All right. This is Dreamful Chapters. I've uh, done a couple of videos on it previously. And uh, today's video is in uh, celebration of the release of um, uh, Chapter 3. They're called Chapters. It's Dreamful Chapters. Chapter 3 of 5 in Dreamful Chapters. Um, chapter 2 ended on a bit of a huge cliffhanger. Uh, I'm assuming the way it usually goes is is we'll get the uh, the, the alternate storyline first, so it won't spoil too much if you watch this video. I'm not going to tell you what the the huge uh, ending to a uh, to chapter two was. Uh, so, if you've not seen any of the uh, any of my previous videos or any other videos about this, it's uh, it's an episodic uh, adventure game. In a 3D world, it's it's essentially a point and click, except in 3D. Um, it's a sequel to the two previous um, games, Dreamfall and Dreamfall: Longest Journey. Uh, basically, the company that does it uh, had had a Kickstarter to uh, buy the rights to develop the game from Funcom, I think, and uh, and uh, yeah finish off the story from the first two which is really popular I'm going to um, try turning the sound down that's, that's a bit better we'll leave the dialogue up high that's it, right so I'll start book three so Ooh, consequences. So this will be uh, some spoilers. So if you don't want plot spoilers, look away now. And I'll keep talking and try not to discuss them too much. Um, here we go. So this is the, the first main character, Zoe Mayer Castillo. Um... She was part of the second Dreamfall um, game. Uh, she's she's a natural dreamer, which means she can move between uh, the real inverted commas world, which is like a cyberpunk future world, uh, based in our timeline, though essentially, and um, dream time, sort of story time, as they call it. So, uh, yes, the, the actual text here refers to what I did with the character in the uh, first chapter, which is a nice touch. Uh, yep. We will we'll not discuss that, because it probably is a spoiler. And that's also a spoiler. They're all tying into the plot. More spoilers. It's a good job though, because it's kind of hard remembering. With three months between the episodes, it's kind of hard keeping track. You may want to wait until the end. The main reason to buy it now is that uh, it's half price, which I think is the cheapest it's ever been. And to be honest, I've played the first two chapters for 18 hours in total. So at, you know, 11.50 or whatever it is, it's already pretty good value. Uh, so this is the second character, Kian Alvani. Now he uh, he lives in an alternate reality to, in quotes, our world, which is like a sort of fantasy sword and sorcery type world. The two stories are tied together. We we we're told this. They've not yet actually been tied together, but that's part of the plot. And uh, yeah. Some more spoilers, if you ever intend to play the game, still keep your eyes shut during this bit. Oh. So that's interesting, in that I didn't actually make that choice. So, uh, we shall maybe see. I'll, uh, I'll post on the forums. 
and find out what's going on. Yeah, more spoilers. So, like I said, I'm assuming we're starting with Kian. If we're not, there'll be a lot more spoilers here. And it's a bit slow. I should point out, I am downloading uh, five other games that have all been updated today in the Steam client in the background, which may affect the disk speed access. It's not just poor performance in the game, it's poor performance in my PC. Because, of course, recording this at the same time. So, yeah, this is not... Although the uh, structure is similar to the uh, Telltale Games series... Uh, oh, the interlude. So it's not really a spoiler, this bit. Although the structure is similar to the Telltale Games uh, stuff. Uh, so the last time we saw this character, Gaga. she was a baby. Goals updated. Yeah, it's like it's a tutorial, but I'm fairly Dad, sure. Please come to the kitchen. I've read all of them at least twice already. Uh, good for you. Yeah, in order to get all the achievements, uh, to keep in order to get all the achievements, you can't uh, you can't just play the game through once like like with the Telltale games. Dad, you, you have to. Alone. You have to go back. There we go. You have to go back and uh, try alternate paths, which is maybe where it's gotten confused. Sure you heard me. Can you please do me a favor? What is it? You know I love your beautiful drawings, but I don't like it when you leave them all over the place. Can you please pick them up, put them in your room, and after that I need you to start your homework. Why is it called homework? I'm always home. Ha uh ha. -huh. Why is it homework when I never go anywhere? I think it should be called just work. Uh, good question. And you're right. I need you to clean up and then do your work. Alright? Excellent. Let's but negotiate. Just a little bit more time, please. Please. You've had plenty of time already, Saga. And I need your help. I can only do so much on my own. But I promise I'll do it very, very soon. I just want to play a little more. Please, sweetheart. I'm very tired. I'm trying my best, but you're not making it any easier when you fight me on every little thing. All right, all right. I'll start cleaning up already. As soon as you've finished, I'll help you with your home. With your work. Okay. So we have a quest, which uh, collect all your drawings, which is good excuse to explore the house. No drawings there. So here's a full 3D environment. Um, oh yeah, we can run. Shift run. There's a book. It's not the drawing, right? That door is a special door. It goes into the wall. <laughs> See? <laughs> it's a door that goes into the wall. Excellent. It's not a real door. So this is a house that exists uh, outside of uh, normal space and time. Uh, to learn. I want to be a singer-songwriter. So, it's not entirely clear. So it's first drawing. Excellent. It's not entirely clear uh, what its relationship to the main story is, but I'm sure it will become apparent in the next couple of chapters. Um, Now it's likely this will be a bit dull as I uh, go around. I'm sure there'll be some sort of puzzle involved. If that's see that looks like a drawing. Can I take that? 
The first shift. Ah, uh, cunning. Put up over a scary picture. Are you doing what I told you to do? Yes, I'm cleaning up. Good. Seven more drawings. So having found two of them, and having talked about what the game is and what it's like, uh, I think you've generally got the idea. I've I've really enjoyed it, like I said. Uh, the first two chapters, which is only 40% of the game, I've spent 18 hours on so far. So, um, it's, it's, uh, you know, I've, I've opened and closed it and gone through various different, uh, various different scenarios to, uh, to find out all the things and get all the achievements. It's, uh, if you're into that sort of thing, you'll definitely get the time out. If you just want to play it through the story once, probably it's about half that time so far. But again, this is the, uh, you know, the middle fifth of the entire game. Uh, I don't like that picture. It keeps changing. I think it's a lie. So yeah, check it out on Steam. It's half price right now. If you like uh, story-based adventure games, uh, this is one of the one of the few of the current crop that is available natively on Linux, and uh, definitely worth checking out. <laughs>